did you miss me? <laughs> For some strange reason, I always get an urge to sleep with a guy after a breakup from a long-term lesbian relationship. I quite fancy my neighbour, so I invited him to come and fix my shower head. But then he bent over to pick something up and I saw his hairy butt crack. And that idea went out of the window faster than you could say Portia de Rossi DeGeneres. Even if I hadn't seen his hairy butt crack, I know I still wouldn't have wanted to suck his dick or smell him. Blech. But there are girls who would, you know. They love sucking the penis as much as they love licking the pussy. And just because I don't understand why a chick likes dick, doesn't mean that bisexuals don't exist. I know I've been a bit mean about bisexuals in the past, and I vowed I wouldn't go near another one with a barge pole. But I got chatting to a bisexual chick on Twitter, and she seemed quite sweet for a bisexual. I decided to invite her over, and she turned up on her bicycle in the middle of the night like a delicious hot pizza, dripping with melted cheese, begging me to take a bite. Hmm. She told me she was bilingual and teaching biology and biochemistry, and that made me quite hot because she had nice biceps too. The other lesbians on Twitter warned me not to look her in the eyes, but she took off her bifocals, and before I knew it, we were kissing and kissing and kissing some more. By Jove, who knew bisexuals liked to kiss? It was bloody brilliant, actually. Mm. So, I'd like to make a public apology to the bisexual community for being biased towards bis because I had a bad experience with a bi girl once. You know who you are, you bi -itch.